Hi guys, today we are going to talk about a Chicago artist currently living, currently working. Her name is Sam King and um, I think you're going to love her style. She does a lot of murals but she's also been commissioned to do posters for different festivals, the um, U.S. Census, and even to do some work for Adidas in um, Finish Line stores. So I am excited to share her art with you and we'll see what you think. All right, here we go. Samantha Kirk was born in Chicago in 1981. In Kirk's sophomore year of high school, she discovered art was an outlet for her to communicate her queer identity, which she later integrated into her artwork. Later in life, Kirk worked in the advertising industry as an integrated market marketing specialist for 10 years. Eventually leaving the industry, Kirk felt the advertising industry no longer challenged her. Sam Kirk, multiple disciplinary artist from Chicago and Brooklyn, explores culture, identity, and urban politics through her art. Born and raised on the south side of Chicago in a mixed-race family, she's always been fascinated with community and culture, taking experiences from her own upbringing and merging them with insights obtained during travel. Her work is known for its vibrant color palette, whimsical characters, and profound stories of optimism. Sam Kirk creates artwork to celebrate people and to inspire pride and recognition for underrepresented communities. Her work walks the viewer through various moments focusing on a celebration of culture, discovery of identity, and the politics that people have been fighting for generations. She was born and raised in the south side of Chicago, and she spent most of her family life growing up there in her neighborhoods, exploring new communities and cultures with each move. This is some of her artwork. In cuisine bowls with 20% more food for 20% more satisfaction. They're nutritious and delicious. New Lean Cuisine Bowls. Delicious your way. You're broken down and tired of living life on a merry-go-round. And you can't find a fighter. But I see it in you, so we gon' walk it out. Move mountains We gon' walk it out and move mountains And I rise up, I rise like the day I rise up, I rise unafraid I rise up and I do it a thousand eight times again and I rise up, I like the waves, I rise up, in spite of the ache, I rise up, and I do it a thousand times again, you, 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 you. The silence is quiet And it feels like it's getting hard to breathe And I know you feel like dying But I promise we would take the world to its feet Move my dance Bring it to its feet Think. Pretty cool, right? Like her style? 
And I think it's pretty cool. I like how she, um, her style is very fluid. She can be painting soccer players. She can be play, painting um, people of different races and color. She really seems to be able to grasp and um, reflect a certain community's culture. And I really like that about her style. It's like she listens to a community's culture and she can reflect that in her artwork. So we are going to create a little art in her style, in her inspiration. Um, and you guys should get some handouts from staff of some outlines of faces. And I will give you a little demonstration of what I want you to do. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is one of Sam's artworks. And in the background are all these little doodles of things from her personal culture, street sign, um, different buildings, lots of buildings, but they all have names of significant places that are important to her. I want you to do the same thing, thinking about either your city, your street, the block you live on, and all the things that you like most about your culture and where you live. All right, staff will give you a handout of this coloring sheet that is created by Sam Kirk. It's one of her um, posters, actually. And you can use this as a reference for ideas as to what to put in your background um, for your city designs. But you can also trace the faces or the bodies of the people in this picture if you want to add them to your picture as well. Okay, so in summary, you are going to create an artwork just like Sam Kirk's, only you're going to be incorporating pictures in the background, drawings in the background, that are of your favorite places or characteristics of your community. It can be your town, it can be your state, it could be just your street or your block, but all the places that um, you absolutely love about your community. And then somewhere in there, I want you to add a picture of yourself, like in the first example I gave you. Um, you can add more people if you want, but I definitely want a picture in there that represents yourself. And I don't care if you have to trace it to get the body proportions correct. That's absolutely fine with me. And then you can add details to make it look more like you. But I'm really excited to see what you guys come up with. I love that this artwork is going to be representational of where you come from and your city and community story as well as just a little biography a little biography of yourself and like the places that you like to go best and um, what you like to do with your time or what you like in a city and community and what you take pride in so I'm anxious to see that too and if you would like to write notes about why you incorporated what you did into your artwork, um, why you like those places, why they're important to you. I would love to read that as well. Do that on a separate sheet and just make sure that your name's on it so I know that it goes along with the picture that you created. Um, but I'm excited to see what you guys come up with and um, I hope you have fun with this, all right? Take care. See you soon.